Hello. Hi. Um, it's me again. Bringing you a rather different video today. I'm just wanted to do this because I'm basically <laughs> it's a reskin tutorial. So I'm going to be talking you through how to download reskins for Train Simulator 2017. Um, so I'm just going to run you through it. It is. First of all, if you're not used to this sort of um, operation with all these files, it can be a bit daunting at first, but once you get the hang of it, it is really easy. Um, so yeah, let's just get into it. So I have a Class 1 Fag 3, Great Western Railway, uh, um, reskin just here from Super Alps. So we're just going to, this is going to be the example I'm going to do it with. Uh, it's a very new reskin, I think. I only just found it before this video. I was going to do it with a 166, but I found it. So yeah, yeah, it was. A yeah. So let's go. Um, so I'm just going to double click on this file, and it'll bring up. Oh, it says I've got an expired thing, but I haven't. Um, so you can get a load of different programs that can extract packages, because that's normally what you do with this. So you can see we've got um, uh, we've got a reskin manual here, the actual reskin, and a destinations.txt file, which I've never really been sure how it works. Um, but yeah. So what we need to do now is we need we need to um, extract. Normally, I'm just ass literally I'm just assuming. That you extract that you extract all reskins because that's normally what you have to do. So I create go into <coughs> a downloads folder, create a new folder, and then there is plus one five three. I know it's saved from documents, it doesn't really matter. Okay, and it'll do a loading thing, and then you can click off uh, whichever unzip program you're using. Go to documents, or that documents for me. This one. Great Western Railway, and then you have all this. And because my PDF doesn't work, I'm gonna have to open this manual in Chrome. Just give it a bit. So this is gonna be quite an easy reskin to download. Is it's only gonna be one car. We don't have to copy ma many files over. Yeah, see, it's just the JT one five three. So these are just all the instructions you need. So extract the contents of this archive. So we've done that. Navigate to Rare Works and Software. So you need to click on click on that. And then normally your Rare Works directory is in Windows, Program Files, um, Steam, and then Steam Apps, Common, and then Rare Works. And the installation instructions tell you to go to a folder called um, Utilities, um, and this is basically when y whenever you download a marketplace reskin for this, this is where it goes. So here we are. Yep. And then it'll load up this program, and then you need to download the reskin, which is an RWP file. Um, so you go to Documents. Uh, Great West Railway, and it's there. Normally, it free sometimes it freezes on this downloading thing. It depends on the size of the folder. Hopefully, this is going to be quite quick because um, it's only a one-car train. Okay, so now it's downloaded. Um, we'll just follow the next step. It'll, it'll say there's a, that green bar will disappear, 
for this next step. Um, so I've done that, then press open. So <coughs> once the green bars has appeared, close package manager. Now you need to head to this directory, which is we're already in the RareWorks folder, which is helpful. So basically, in here, this is these are all of the people who make trains for RareWorks. So we have AP with the the fifty pack, the sound pack, the three, two, one pack. Uh, Chris Trains with his jet train, or the jet train, DTG, but the one we need to go to is just trains, uh, which is, here we are, class 153, rail vehicles, diesel, 153, and basically these are all the liveries you get, so AR is Anglia Railways, ATW, Eve Trains, Rail, CT Central Trains. Um, so we've got all of these here, and the and these are basically because it says we've got the GWR one, but the one where we're, we're actually putting the paint over, if you like, the painting over the the, the what the first Great Western one. Um, so we need to go into FGW Engine, and then we need to copy the. G O P C D X file into the G W R engine file. Um, I think I've done it right. Yep. And that's basically how you do it. But I'm just going to load Train Simulator up just to show you that it has worked. Now it says clear the cache down there, but I've had some encountered some problems with that in the past. So normal, so I don't do it, but normally it works. Just wait for that to load. There we are. Now I apologise, I haven't turned down my graphic settings, so that the frame rate is probably going to be awful. I'm recording and I'm on higher graphics at the same time. Um, so let's just go to drive. And you'll be able to see all the other three skins I have. So I've got the Virgin Trains one. So that's the one we reskinned. I don't think it's in there though. No, that's just my custom one. Here it is. Class 153, Great Western Railway, one car. So we'll take it on the uh, the least laggy one, I think, is going to have to be the Riviera line. So we'll take it from Paynton to Exeter St. David's and then start. So I have, I do hope you found this video interesting. I'm just going to round it off with drive. Just, I won't drive this 153, I'll just do a little pan around it and show the different stuff it comes with. I also got the sound pack for it recently, the one that's for the 150, 153 and 156. They're pretty much all the same, but yeah. As you can see here, we've got some pretty exciting routes coming out for Trainsim. Or are out. Yeah, out now. And you can also see Just Trains again. DTG sometimes these are the ma train makers in the thing North London and Goblin lines I have to admit, that does look good. Cause it doesn't just have the Gospel Oaks Barking line, it has part of the C2C lines and the West London line. And we're in already, that was really quick, actually. So we're in our 1-5... Oh gosh, that frame rate 
It's not bad, actually. I'm going to give you that. So here we are. It looks really good, actually. I'm pretty, I'm pretty good with that. So, just to show you the AP sound pack. <coughs> that is coming through pretty loud on my headphones. Um, so let's just train set up. Open the doors. And some don't expect this with all reskins. But some will have a modified passenger view. Yeah, for example, like this one. This is just the FGW one. With the same... Oh, the doors are closed. It's the same person who stares at you. So, let's just... I, I, I think I'll just do a little thing of this train leaving. Okay, so just speeding. Okay, so before I go, I just want to say thank you very much for watching this video. Uh, I hope you found it informative and maybe a bit interesting at the same time. Okay, see you.